Welcome to Imperial Nurseries. It's October, my favorite time of the month, and my friend Igor and I, we're gonna be searching around the nursery for other monsters. And there's plenty of them here at Imperial. Don't you think so, Igor? Yes, yes, Hunchback, whatever you say. So let's go in search of them, Igor. Let's we'll go our, find we'll some. We'll leave our house in Granby here, and we'll head out. I'm the Hunchback of Granby. By the way, when we're through today, you can all come back to our home and we'll sit down to lunch together. Watch your step, Igor. Watch your step. Watch your step. All right, we're here at the Granby farm and we're looking at a two-chip kind of green giant, a full eight foot tall, with my friend Igor here and I'm the hunchback. Just wanted to let you know that we're not going to be trimming anymore this year. We trimmed a few employees with the shears here, but we're not trimming any more of the plants this year. They'll be this full grade. Look at this beautiful monster here. It is well over eight feet tall. I have to straighten, my back. Be straighten as... my back to see how tall it is. It is not as, it's not as nice looking as I am. <laughs> That's but, for sure. That's but for sure. it will help to screen out all your ugly neighbors. A second that thought. What do we have here? Hunchback! What is this plant here? It's, a, we... it's a Cunningham white rhododendron. Cunningham's white. It's wow. still popping a bloom, just like I popped out my eye last week. I get plenty of blooms popping on it still this time of year. It's beautiful green color. It's got, it's got buds all over it. It looks like a 10 gallon, but it's in a five gallon pot. What do you think, Igor? That is absolutely beautiful. Unbelievable for spring and for now. Again, it's not as beautiful as, as you. But, but you need a haircut. it's still a beautiful plant. Igor, you need a haircut. You hey, started haircut, a little too much. Haircut. A little bit of haircut. Oh no, my hair. Hey, let's move on to the next plant, huh? Let's Igor, move on to the next move on. plant. Ah, hunchback. What do we have here? This, PJ Everett? This is my favorite plant of all time. You know why? Why? Because it's one of the very first ones to bloom in the spring. That's true. And here at Imperial, we do a beautiful job of growing it. Look at the size of this baby. It's truly a monster, isn't it's it? It's truly a monster. For a five gallon. I might it looks off. like a ten to me. Are you sure it's a five it's gallon? It's a five, and we got plenty of them. Just scan the nursery here, and you'll see. They're everywhere. Mountains and mountains of PGM monsters. They're mass producing these PGM monsters all over Imperial. Be sure to get your five gallon PJMs now. Let's put it back in the cage so it doesn't back get in the out. Cage. Back in back the cage. Back in the cage. Back in the cage. Hello again, everyone. What I'm looking at here is a beautiful 10 gallon maximum pink rhododendron. And as you can see, oh, Hunchback, Hunchback! What have we got here, Hunchback? It's a 10 gallon Nova Zembla. Sorry wow. to interrupt you. I was just telling them about the 10 gallon maximum pink. Oh. Look at this yeah. monster. It's huge and loaded with buds. Look at that, Hunchback. Absolutely gorgeous landscape, great size. In my opinion, 42 inch? Is that what about it is? Uh, it's, a, it's about a 42 inch. That's, this is the one with the blood red color, isn't it, Hunchback? That's right, you're absolutely right. And this one, it's the pink color that you can use in dense shade. It works pretty well. Nice That's pink beautiful. Color. Again, it's 10 gallon Nova Zumbler and 10 gallon maximum pink. Get them now before we sell through all of them. They're horrifyingly beautiful, horrifyingly. So what do you think? Put them back in the house? I think we should put them back. Back in the cage. With their Let's other go. friends. Back in the couch. Greetings, my friends. Hunchback, what have we here? Well, this is a 10 gallon Browns Beauty. 30 inches wide, 36 inches wide, actually. And it's at least 30 to 36 inches in height as well. And they're pruned so well by our great growers on Imperial. Pruned perfectly. Perfect round shapes with plenty of bud count for spring. 
It looks beautiful, and what a monster it is! Look at this hunchback. Not gonna keep this secret too long on the farm, that's for sure. I guess we don't need to hear that anymore, but what do you think about my hair? Should yes, we cut my hair? Need another cut already. Cut again. my hair, Mr. Thank another you, cut. Hunchback. Another cut. Thank you. Okay, on to the next plant. On to the next one. Greetings, my fellow trick-or-treaters. Hunchback, do you know what we have here? I believe it's a Montgomery spruce in a five gallon. That's 30 I, inches. I believe you're right. I love this plant, Hunchback. Do you know why? Why is that? Well, first of all, it's got the most beautiful blue color. Although I not. still like the color of my hair better, don't you, Hunchback? I don't know. I think I prefer the sky blue color of the Montgomery spruce, really. Well, the other thing I like about this plant is that it never needs trimming. It seems I'm always having to trim my beautiful, beautiful hair. Yeah, you're right about that. <laughs> <laughs> this plant is measuring better than 30 inches wide, and it will have a beautiful, beautiful dark blue flush come the springtime. I think everyone needs one of these, don't you, Hunchback? I definitely do. I love it in any landscape. So just a beautiful plant. Beautiful plant. Okay, let's to move next, on. To the next. We have to head back to our laboratory now. You know they only let us out once a year. We're going to be working on some more monster plants here in Imperial. And one thing I have to tell you, I have a hunch you'll be back. We have to go inside and look for some more victims, I mean plants now. Have a good evening. Have a bloody good Halloween.